Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Kerbal Space Program. Anyway, today I was having to think about what we could do, and I noticed down here in Mission Control, we have this Orbit Kerbin, which uh, is going to be a bit mad to do, but never mind, I think we should do it. And there is also another one, where is it? Test Thumper Solid Fuel Booster in Flight Over Kerbin. So yeah, we should be able to do this as well. Okay then, in the cockpit is Samantha Kerman. I don't know if she'll survive this or not, but like, let's see. Ignition in three, two, one. Our missions. We've just got to get to 3,000 meters. These big solid rocket boosters, which we should be able to do. Completed, nicely done. And now we just have to orbit Kerbin. And look at that heat, though. Let's drop those. Man, our apoapsis is massive. This isn't going to end well. Right, we're approaching Apoapsis in a few moments, so, yeah. I might as well start the burn now, like, while we're here. Let's see if we've, we've even got enough uh, Delta V to make the gravity turn, or are we going to come down? Nope, we're coming down. We don't have enough juice in the tank. Never mind. Let's keep ourselves pointed down like this. And pray that the re-entry forces aren't overly hostile. I say pray. I'm not holding out that much, you know. This is gonna hurt. This is gonna kill us. Come on, we're so close! Ah, oh, we made it! Excellent! So that Science Junior is pretty warm now, good grief! We're now below 300 meters a second, two kilometers up. It might be time to pull the chutes about now. Bring us down to a very gentle speed. 99 Science! Wow, okay. Well, we did well then. There we go. We've got better fuel tank there. A new step ahead in rocket technology, so that would probably make a lot of sense. Well, these could be very important. We've got launch stabilizers, rocket max decouplers, rocket max adapters, and strut connectors. But what else is there? Oh, you see. Yeah, I'm going to say general construction would make more sense right now. Okay then. We're ready to go. We've upgraded the rocket, it's now more aptly staged to complete our contract to test the thumpers. We've also got a bigger main fuel tank for the uh, liquid engine. And we've got these supports to make our takeoff a bit better. So, Samantha, prepare yourself. Okay. I don't know what happened then. Uh, we failed is what happened then. But Samantha survived at the very least. Uh, let's do a quick crew report. Might as well get some science from that. Engines on. And go. So all of the prerequisites for the Rocco Max thing, or the Thump thing, are met now. I'm going to have to do it. Launch. There we go, Thumper is done. Mission complete for that one, at least. Okay. <laughs> Let's see if we can start doing that turn. It doesn't seem to want to. There's not very much uh, torque on this rocket, so we're struggling to do the turn. But we are making some progress with it. 
though I dread to think what the Aquapsis looks like right now. It's going to be so big. 255,000 kilometers. Okay. We might be able to do something with that. It's a bit shorter than the last one, actually, so it's not terrible. I guess now's as good a time as any. Good luck. I just hope we've got enough fuel to do the burn to get us back. That'd be embarrassing. Come on. Ah, oh, we just ran out. Never mind. But we are a lot closer now. That's more of an orbit than it was last time. Come on, we're nearly down. We're nearly down. Don't blow up now. That heat shield did its job. Things might be a bit warm for a bit, but still, we've made it in one piece. How much science have we got now? 26.6, and for our next bit, which is flight control, we need another, well, we need 45 in total, so we're getting there. Good luck, Samantha. There we go. Nearly forgot to turn the SAS on then. That could have been embarrassing. Let's try and do that turn now. It'd be nice if our uh, little winglets on the sides actually turned so we could rotate the craft a bit more, but never mind. Maybe that can be an update for the next one. Come on. We need more torque. There we go, come on. We got this. We were a bit late, we burnt after the apoapsis, so... We're on the back foot now. Which is a bit problematic, but I think we can still do it. Strictly speaking, we're accelerating uh, ourselves towards the ground, but then again... I don't know. That was, that was quite an ill-timed burn, if I'm honest. That's annoying. The way we should be doing it is we should be burning just before, and then the apoapsis should be getting further away from us. But it looks like we're going to manage orbit. Just about. Come on! There we go! There we go, it's just said we've orbited Kerbin, which is very nice. Contract complete. Great job, we got 12 science, 30 XP and a lot of cash. I'll have to, play, I'll have to pay back that bank loan soon, so uh, technically not cheating anymore. There we go. Loads of stuff completed then. Excellent. Let's admire our handiwork. We should be due an amazing sunrise or something around the, the side of Kerbin in a moment. Oh, look at that. It's moments like this that make this game even more special. And then you see that haze of the atmosphere of Kerbin beneath us. That looks wonderful. But anyway, guys, landing this is a mission for another day. So thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. Take it easy. Have a good day. Bye-bye.